Hello to everybody. If you happen to be the lucky owner of a fairy hair, you know the fairy hair? Then maybe once, it's very seldom, but um, it could happen that a string snaps. So in this case, I want you to be able to replace the string, the new one. So that's what I want to show today. So if you want um, to put to fix a new string on your fairy hair, you need the following tools. You need a tuning key with a square hole of four millimeter. You need a round ply edges plier, looks like this. And you need a cutter plier, like this. And you need the material, you need a string. Have it in a row. So let's start. You take the end of the string and push it through from this side to this pin. And push it through as much as you want so that it's comfortable to make the next step. The make, next step is maybe the most challenging one. It's you have to make a hook, a little hook at the end. So you take your round plier and put it in a 90 degree position to the very end of the string. Like this. Now you take your thumb and press again, press against this place here. And make sure that you keep this 90 degree angle to more, more or less this point so that you receive a hook like this. Then you pull in the hook to the pin and make sure that the hook shows away from you. This. And the very, very end should touch the pin so that you cannot, that is more stable at one hand and on the other hand that you don't hurt yourself at the end of the pin because uh, of the string because it's quite sharp. So now you pull from this side, you take the tuning key, insert it to the pin, turn leftwise, two half turns, so one, one full turn, 360 degrees. Make sure that the windings go downwards. Yes. Next step, you go to the other side. You take the cutter plier and cut around five to six centi from the end. From the end of the pin, I mean. Next step, you go back to the first pin and push it through the hole again. Pull it as far as you can, like this, don't force too much. So now you go with the end of the string to the second pin and push it through. Now take the round plier and now make sure that you don't, um, um, that you don't have, uh, get, a, get a bending in this with the with string at the position of the pin. So now you come again with a 90 degree angle. You grab the string and make the second hook. And the same thing, make sure that you keep this 90 degree angle, otherwise you will receive a, a spiral and that's not so good. For you. So now you pull the hook in again, make sure that the hook shows away from you. Now it's good to have ex assistance otherwise because you need more or less at least three hands for this, somebody to hold the instrument and with your left hand you make a three point grip like this to stretch the um, 
the string and at the same time to pull it down to the to the wood. Now I'm taking the tuning key, going to the second pin and turning leftwise. And make sure that the that the bindings go downward again. And I'm turning, 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 carefully, carefully, carefully. And to the point I feel that the string is stretching. Tension. So the first tone is coming. And now you have to orientate with another instrument or with a tuning app to make sure that you get the note that you really need. That's it.